Hey guys, Steve here. We're at Ouroboros Farms. As you can see, we've transplanted the first pumpkin. The other guy is going to sit in here overnight. i got to go get another pot. I thought we had another pot around, so I'm going to get another pot. Um, this is actually inside of a smaller system here. Uh, we have some catfish down there. A little IBC tote. A little door on it. Around here, we have some greens. It's an old test grow. Um, we're in the process of converting it over, and uh, as you can see, here's the rest of the farm. Ouroboros Farms. OuroborosFarms.com. Anyways, we're going to grow this uh, pumpkin. We got it here in a dual root zone pot. As you can see, we filled it up. The media ends just uh, a little bit below the line here, and then there's a layer of burlap with our soil on top. We pre-measured it where we took uh, this cup right here. It turns out about 12 of these is enough for the water to fully saturate the soil layer and come out the bottom. So I'm going to use six of these going forward. If I were going to top water, six, maybe eight of them with water plus a you know, water base from the system with a little bit of nutrient or from our remineralization tanks back there or compost tea tanks. And that allows us to top feed and top dress without really worrying about getting much water into the bottom of the system. If there is a little bit, it's just 5% or so or less. And we don't have to worry about nutrient um, contamination or you know killing the fish or anything like that unless you're using something like yucca extract or zinc, um, zinc uh, isolates. Um, can't think of anything else that would kill them that fast otherwise. Handful of other stuff, but not many that you guys are using regularly. So be sure not to use yucca extract if you are doing this method with fish. Anyways, thanks a lot for watching, and um, we'll have more content, and uh, you know, great to follow these pumpkins and watch them go along. I thought it'd be a great way to do a uh, nice little uh, follow-up on a dual root zone video, maybe one geared a little bit more towards large